<laughs> I made Jared do yeah. that. But how fun is this? It's Christmas. We have to start the vlog in a fun, Christmassy, seasonal way, right? Yep. <laughs> What is up? We hope you guys are all having a great day. It is getting so close to Christmas. We're just a few days away now. Yeah, we're getting close, guys. The countdown is on, and that is for sure. Best of all, Brittany is starting to feel a little bit better. Just a quick update for you guys. Oh my goodness, yes. Update on my tooth, you guys. I am feeling better. I'm still taking some pain medicine, which definitely helped. So far, so good. No swelling or anything. I do have a few cankers up where they removed it, so I'm a little nervous because last time I had dental work done, the canker spread everywhere. So It was like the zombie movie. It was gross. <laughs> Jared, don't say it was gross. It was gross, but it was painful. I couldn't even open my mouth. I couldn't eat. I couldn't do anything. Do you remember that? I literally just like have to drink stuff. Nothing could touch the sides. It was bad, you guys. We won't get into that. This is a oh. Christmas vlog. No one wants to hear about that. I remember we went on this really fun trip to Maui and her mouth was packed with cankers. And it's right when we started vlogging <laughs> and it was like the most painful thing. So Jared would do most of the talking because I literally couldn't even really Actually, talk. we did not vlog anything from that trip. We tried to, we attempted, but that's right. every we time Brittany spoke, she was just like, I hate this. I can't even breathe. Like, yeah, it was bad. My mouth hurts too much. So we do have some footage from that trip. We'll have to show you guys it. I did make a really cool video over on our Instagram that we posted last year. Remember that video? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It was right around Christmas time, right? Yeah. Anyway, it's crazy. If you guys haven't seen it, definitely go on and check it over on our Instagram at Jared and Britt because I think it was really cool. It was a cool edit. But we have things to do, things to pick up, and we are sitting in the parking lot at none other than Costco. Costco. And who doesn't love a good Costco haul? But what's even better this time is it's a Christmas Costco haul. And I bet it's going to be a madhouse in there. So it's, it's be going to be a crazy Costco <laughs> Christmas haul. Oh my gosh, he stole my thunder. Crazy <laughs> Costco Christmas haul. Wait, haul. <laughs> It's a tongue twister already. Yeah. Who's up for it though? I'm excited. I want to get in the craziness. Costco always has the best things around the holidays. They just oh, do it just right. Just in general. Yeah, they totally do it right. But you guys, I just wanted to say thank you to everyone out there for wishing me well with my whole tooth extravaganza, I guess you could say. But really, thank you for all the sweet comments and well wishes and sharing your stories with me as well. It really helped me know kind of what to prepare for and look out for. So you guys are the best. So thank you, thank you. Yeah, thanks a ton. You guys rock. But anyway, enough with that boring stuff. Just Let's my health and well-being, but whatever. <laughs> I say we get into Costco. I want to sample some eggnog. Oh my gosh. We are picking some stuff up for Christmas Eve. I'm in charge of a salad, so we got to pick up some different things. And then we're also, you guys, we're super excited because as you know, we are giving Christmas to a family in need this year. We're actually helping a few different individuals, which we're super excited about. Stay tuned for tomorrow's vlog because we're going to be sharing more on that. But we are going to see if some of the items that are needed we can find here in Costco as well. So we might share some of those with you, but for sure, make sure you come back tomorrow because that is gonna be a really special vlog where we shop for a family in need and share that with all of you. So that's gonna be cool. All right, guys, enough of that. Let's head on into this crazy Costco Christmas haul. Try and say that five times fast. Crazy Costco Christmas haul. Crazy Costco Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see how I make it. Okay. Crazy Costco Christmas haul. Crazy Costco Christmas haul. Crazy Costco Christmas. <laughs> okay, we'll see you guys. <laughs> Yes, you guys, Jared just picked me up from work, so I'm a little bit overdressed for Costco. <laughs> Classy, crazy Costco Christmas haul. Okay guys, we're in front of these little jackets right now. And the reason that this is important is because Brittany actually had one of these that she got from Costco a couple years ago. Seriously, best, best coat ever. Best, best coat ever. They're the really thin coats, but they are super, super warm. Oh However, God. when we got Finley as a puppy, he chewed a hole through it. In my sleeve, so we super glued it. <laughs> and it looks like garbage. And I've kept it. I wear it almost every day. I don't have it on right now. I have a dressier coat on, but I usually wear it every day because it's so warm. It's my favorite. But these are Nautica. Look at this white. I love the white. Jared, you have I know. the white, the black. There's some gray, but look at that. $30. I don't like the white. I do like the white a lot too. You like the white? The white could get a teeny bit dirty, but it does look nice. You guys see? Yeah, I like it. Should we see what it looks like on? Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> that does look good on you. Holy cow. I feel like it's a good length too, like the sleeves. I love how, look, it has the thumb holes. 
for your hand, which keeps your wrist warm and it's like guarded, it's really insulated. It does look good on you, yeah. Hey, look on the back, there's a little black stripe on the hood. That is cool. Yeah, it looks really good with what you have on right now. Costco fashion show. <laughs> I think this is coming home with us. I might even get one of these as a gift for someone on our list as well. These are slipper socks, so they have like the grippy on the bottom, which is nice. For then these cute little mice or cats, so cozy, so warm and fluffy. I think someone on their list is gonna like these. <laughs> that was pretty good. Look at these shoes I just found. These are Skechers, but how cute are these? And they're like the flex. So you just slip your foot in. Oh, that's but way they cool. Look super comfy. They're a great price, $24.99. These are my favorite types of shoes, you guys. The tongueless kind. Tongueless? Yeah, they don't have a tongue. Shoe tongue. Oh, is that what it's called? That's what it's called, yeah. Like the thing that you pull <laughs> up before you tie them? I never knew that. <laughs> if you guys knew that, comment down below. Or if I'm totally wrong. Also comment or that down just below. Falling issues, tongueless. <laughs> Whatever. No, but yeah, these don't have a tongue. You just slip them on. That's way cool. My <laughs> mom, I know she's been wanting some shoes, so I might get a pair of these for Miss Glenna. See if she likes those. Those look like comfy too. Found some for my dad too. You guys check out these awesome IDs. Adidas. <laughs> Adidas. Adidas. I think these are really cool. Yeah, Warren's gonna love those. Yeah, my dad's been going to the gym a lot and I think he's gonna love these. So you guys, one of the families we're shopping for, there's two little boys, they're brothers. One is nine and one is 12. They're asking for some new pants. How awesome are these little Adidas sweatpants? And they are $12. Yeah, it's a good steal. Such good quality. They look awesome. So we're definitely going to pick up a pair of these for each of them. I think they'll love them. Jared. <laughs> uh, we don't have a kid yet. Uh, but how cute is this for when we do? <laughs> One step at a time, baby. Look how cute that is. There's a little bow on the front, too. Jared's gonna kill me, but look how cute this is. Jared, some bunny loves you. <laughs> and some bunny has something on their mind. Just how soft this is. Oh, that is soft. It's a snuggly little baby in this. <laughs> one, one step at a time, babe. One step. Don't pack that one. <laughs> Just preparing now for the future, right? We can <laughs> I've never tried these. If you like mint, these are a must. So these are milk chocolate <laughs> truffle mints. You guys, they melt in your mouth. So, so good. If you have a mint lover out there, definitely pick some of these up. This would make a great neighbor gift. You just throw a bow around this and it'd be awesome. kiddos that love Legos like our nieces and nephews do. This looks like the ultimate set. How fun is that? That's way nice. These two little boys on their wish list, you guys, are Legos. So I feel like a set of these would be awesome for them. And look at all the fun things you can build. One thing that I want to snag, guys, while we're here are the gloves that are touch sensitive. Oh, yeah. The winter gloves. I'm wanting some of those. I lost a pair of mine. I absolutely loved them. I actually think we should give them for your parents too. That'd be cool. I got them for my parents and they took them to Ukraine. So they're really, really good gloves. Keep your hands warm. Plus you can also use your phone. You 
guys, these are the gloves I was talking about. Look how you can use them to touch your devices without having to take your gloves off. These are awesome and they're only 12 bucks. Some of our favorite things around the holidays are their shrimp cocktails. So they're pre-cooked, they come with cocktail sauce. This is like the perfect appetizer. I feel like people that love seafood absolutely love these. So we're gonna pick up a few of these. I'm also gonna be making a side dish. One of our favorites is asparagus with lemon and a little Parmesan cheese roasted in the oven. So picking up a few bags of this, I just picked up one of their super food salad kits. I love these, it has a really creamy poppy seed dressing, but to make it kind of festive, if you throw in pomegranate seeds, it makes it really yummy Ooh. and it adds to the color. Yeah, that is like a Christmas salad. Oh, a little quick salad tip there. Oh guys, they just turned off the lights. That means they're starting to close up shop. Cranberry goat cheese. This is popular with crackers. Hi guys, we are just finishing up. We got a, quite a few things in though. Woo! Did you guys ever do this on the cart? We still do it and we are well into our 30s. Well, well one of us is. Yeah, one of us is. Good, we are finding some awesome stuff. Oh, seriously, this is the best time to go and I thought it'd be a lot more hectic than this. It's actually not that crazy, it's because it's closing. Yeah. Wait, crazy Costco Christmas closing, closing haul. <laughs> I like this little game we play. I think we filled up all the time we needed just trying to say the title. Pretty much. <laughs> and Brittany's favorite part, the candy aisle. These are a must. Oh my goodness, what are these? Dark chocolate sea salt snappers. Oh, those are, are you amazing. You need this kind of looks like caramel with the pretzel and the sea salt. That looks amazing Can right there. Get one of these to take yeah. to the cabin. Yeah. Let's do it. Successful trip. I would say that was a successful trip. <laughs> that was pretty quick. You did that pretty fast. We did that super fast. I think that was the fastest Costco haul we've ever had. And we even stopped. We were looking at a ton of different things for Christmas. They have awesome things. So for anyone out there, this video is gonna be going up on Christmas Eve. Run over to your Costco. I think they're still open on Christmas Eve in most places. Yeah. I think mm -hmm. they close earlier than normal, but for sure, lots of good yummy treats and last minute presents as well. Well, one thing that really made a huge difference this time is that usually we go into Costco with like some idea of what we want, but this time we knew exactly what we were looking for. But we definitely found a few things that we didn't know were there. <laughs> yeah. Especially in the treat aisle. Yeah. Can't wait to try those. We'll let you know how they are. Ooh, busy mom. Busy mom. How are you so happy we're home? Are you so happy we're home? Go, 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 Katie. I'll go. I'll go. We are back home <laughs> with our little Philly. He was hanging out with Kong. We are watching Tip and Nick's dog Kong for a few days. They are out of town. It's kind of fun because they are just best buds, you guys, and they keep each other company. Even when we're gone, it's kind of fun knowing that Finn has a friend. Guys, it was super fun to be able to shop tonight doing a little Costco haul, but it was even more fun to be able to shop a little bit for that family. Yeah, you guys, we are so excited. If you guys haven't seen the video where we announced our new family tradition where we are actually giving Christmas to a family in need, then make sure, Jerry, will you link it where they can go check that out? So tonight we, we found a few of the things that we wanted to get them. And so, but tomorrow, stay tuned because that is where we're gonna talk a little bit more about these people we are helping out. And then also we get to do more shopping and then wrap the presents and then go and drop it off, which is gonna be awesome. Which is gonna be the best part. Yeah. I don't know if we're gonna be able to, to vlog that or if we will just yeah. out of you know respect and privacy. But if they're okay with it, then we will. And we'll share that with you guys. We need to put away our groceries. We need to get into bed early tonight because we have a big day ahead of us tomorrow. We have a big few days ahead of us with Christmas and Christmas Eve. Lots of fun stuff going on, so you're not gonna wanna miss any of it. Mm -mm. You guys, we absolutely love you. We hope you're enjoying this Christmas season. There's something in the air about it that we just love. It's just such a great time of year. Also, if you guys are new to this channel, welcome to our YouTube family. 
say, welcome, this is Finley, our puppy. But he's not a puppy, he's full grown, and he's the cutest little thing. We're gonna dress him up as Santa tomorrow, and you guys are gonna die. We showed a little glimpse of it, I know Jared did, but you guys, cutest little outfit ever on this one. <laughs> it's so cute. Anyway, if you guys are new, definitely please subscribe. We would love to have you join our YouTube family, and turn on the notification bell so you know when we post, because you guys are not gonna wanna miss a beat in 2020. That is right. Big year for these two binghams, you guys. Oh, yeah. All right, guys. We're going to wrap this thing up. Head to bed. We love you. Good night. And we will see you all tomorrow for our special Christmas vlog. <laughs> see you guys. Bye. Love you. Bye.